week ahead. We started off this morning with temperatures quite a bit cooler. Many of us were in the 50s and the humidity is going to be low humidity or lack thereof is going to stay in place for the next several days. Tomorrow morning will be just as comfortable with a lot of us down into the 50s again and just not a lot of rain in the forecast for the next several days. So this map gives us an indication of how much moisture is in the air. When you see the blues and the purples, it just says that the air is really, really dry. When we start to get to the yellows, reds and orange, then there's a little more moisture in the atmosphere. It gives us a little better chance for some rain. And you can see as we kind of go forward through much of this week, boy, do we stay dry here in central Alabama. We start to see some moisture increasing to our west as well as to our east here along the, uh, the mid-Atlantic stage. But in between that, at least through Saturday, things stay relatively dry. And then a front tries to move in on Sunday, and we may see a little increase in moisture, and that may translate into a few showers, or at least the chance for a couple of showers on, uh, on Sunday. So that's not until late in the, uh, in the weekend. Now, all that moisture that we saw here kind of pooling along the, uh, the southern mid-Atlantic states, and that's this area that we're going to be watching toward the end of the week that Asheville Hurricane Center says, yeah, we'll likely see an area of low pressure developing here, and it may acquire some tropical or perhaps even some subtropical characteristics, but it looks like that pulls just about due north of us, and so shouldn't impact us here in central Alabama. But as I mentioned, uh, later in the weekend, this is uh, late on Sunday, you can see at least the hint of of a few showers trying to make their way into the Tennessee Valley and maybe North Alabama and perhaps even here in central Alabama too. So that looks to be our next chance for at least a few showers and even then widespread rain does not look promising. Mostly sunny skies. We're at 76 right now in Birmingham. We've got widespread 70s, even some 80s on the other uh, temperature map with uh, Birmingham again at 76, but we've got 81 in Tuscaloosa, some low 70s in the northern spots with 73 there in Coleman. And so by this afternoon, I think most of us will get into the low 80s, maybe a little light northerly breeze at times. By 6, 7 o'clock tonight, we will be dropping down into the 70s. So pretty comfortable evening ahead. And you'll notice for the week ahead, too, we'll be in the low 80s. Sunny skies, dry weather, very comfortable. Tomorrow morning, it will be cool again down into the 50s. You're watching WVTM 13 News.